Deputy Prime Minister for Economic Affairs Office, last week's activities. On January 6th, Mullah Abdul Ghani Biradar Khund held a meeting in his office with the ulamas and tribal leaders of Uruzgan province, attentively addressing their concerns. The leaders highlighted challenges related to drinking water, check dams, and road infrastructure in the province. In response, Mullah Biradar Khund, acknowledging existing constraints, provided assurance of attention and support. Under Mullah Abdul Ghani Biradar Khun's leadership, the National Procurement Commission convened its regular meeting on January 9 at Barmarine Palace. The agenda included discussions on presented projects, with 27 projects brought forth for consideration. Out of these, contracts for 24 projects received approval, while three contracts were referred to sectorial ministries and departments of the National Procurement Commission for comprehensive evaluation. Continuing his active involvement, the Deputy Prime Minister for Economic Affairs chaired the regular meeting of the Economic Commission on January 10th at Marmarine Palace. Following a thorough discussion, it was decided that the Afghanistan Railway Authority should oversee the completion of railway networks from Herat to Torgunday and Anhui to mazar -e sharif The authority is also entrusted with formulating a comprehensive plan for extending the railway from Herat to Kandahar, ultimately reaching Spin Buldag. Moreover, the Economic Commission approved the establishment of the top project secretariat during during this meeting, referring it to the concerned department for recruitment process. Additionally, at the meeting, the Afghan Post Company was awarded a contract to install GPS in transit vehicles, with the company committed to installing GPS on every transit vehicle for a fee of $41 as per the terms of the contract.